Today we're going to take a look at how to add a passcode to your iPad so that you can uh, have a lock on your device to protect you in case you lose or mislay or have your device stolen. The passcode lock will prevent anybody from accessing your device and being able to get into, for example, your Dropbox files, your email, any photos or videos you have stored or anything else on your iPad. So let's have a look at how to set one up. I'm going to click on settings here and under the general tab here I'm just going to scroll down on the right hand side you should be able to see one there that says passcode lock so I'm going to tap passcode lock at the moment it's off I'm going to turn my passcode on and I'm asked to set a passcode for my device so I will be very original and choose one two three four I would maybe suggest something a little more random for your use but today that's what I'm going to use so one some more one two three four just to confirm it and there we go the passcode is now set and on my device so if I put my device into standby and then wake it up here we are as soon as I slide to unlock it's going to say enter the passcode there's no other way to get into the iPad right now without putting the passcode in so I'm going to add it and let's see if I can get back in. So there we are, one, two, three, four. Passcode is on. I'm just going to jump back into the passcode lock screen. Again, every time you do go in here, it's going to ask you to confirm your passcode. And I'm going to show you one more thing on here that's um, not always a well known tip here. You can see on the uh, right hand side there it says simple passcode on. Well, I'm going to slide that to off right now and it's going to prompt me for my passcode I'll put that in and now that I've got that simple passcode off what this means now is I can enter an alphanumeric passcode if I really want so I can have a, a much more secure password than just a four digit number so let me just pick a password here and it will be case sensitive I'll choose uh, Grant Wood and click next, it'll ask me to do it again there we go, capital G, capital W, and click done. So now I have um, a more secure password. I'll go back into my lock screen again. Turn on the iPad, slide to unlock, and look what I get this time. I get the full keyboard, and I can, can choose numbers and symbols and everything else I would like to have. So let's see if I can get back into my device. So there we are, back in again, and now I've got my um, secure alphanumeric password on the device too. So a couple of options there for you on adding passcode locks to your device. The only thing I would say is that to be, um, be aware that once you have set a passcode, the only way to really um, change it is to go back in with the, the correct passcode. If you've forgotten your passcode, then there's always the possibility that we would have to um, restore your device back to original settings in order to reset that. If you want to be additionally extra secure, there is a, an option you'll see on the side here that says erase data. At the moment that one is off, but you can set it to erase all data on the iPad after 10 failed passcode attempts. So that means if somebody tries your passcode, gets it wrong 10 times, your device will wipe all the data on there. That would be the most secure thing to do, but not everybody is comfortable with um, having that turned on. So if you do turn that on, please be sure that you will always remember your passcode because you may end up wiping your own device. So there you go, how to add a passcode. Um, definitely a good option and something that we would encourage you to think about adding to your device in order to secure everything that you have on there.